Hi, this is Drew Erickson talking about money, not math, like always. Um, and today, rather than reviewing anything, I'm here to talk to Jared May, a friend of mine who is the owner of May Bookkeeping Solutions. So hopefully you enjoy our conversation today and it brings you some value. Um, just generally speaking, you guys know a little bit about me. I've talked quite a bit over the past few days, so I just want to get a good chance to introduce Jared and so you guys get to know him. Um, Jared, why don't you tell us a little bit about your business and kind of when you started it? Well, my business is May Bookkeeping Solutions. Um, okay. uh, I started it uh, just a couple of months ago. Uh, really, the foundation of it is I've worked in uh, accounting jobs for about 25 years. And, uh, and in my uh, previous full-time position for almost 20 years. So I uh, worked kind of in the, the corporate realm with, uh, with uh, uh, bookkeeping and doing the accounting. Uh, so with that experience, I felt like uh, I wanted to reach out on my own and start my own business, help other business owners, small business owners. Uh, I know that's uh, something that business owners need. So, okay. Yeah. So before we get kind of into the, yeah. the nitty gritty of, of what you do exactly, just out of here, you know, get to know you a little bit better. Tell us, so do you have a family? Are you married? Have kids? What's uh, what's your kind of social life look like? Yes, uh, I have a I have a wife and two kids. Uh, my wife uh, and I have been married for about 23 years. Nice, congratulations. Uh, thank you. And uh, I have a daughter who's 18, son who's 15. So a couple of teenagers still in the house. Um, <laughs> Fun ages. Yes. Uh, but other than that, uh, yeah, that. Uh, uh, enjoy my family, spending time together. Um, I moved to, I didn't grow up here. I moved to Thief River Falls in 1995. Okay. Uh, after I had graduated. And uh, that's where I met my wife here. Nice. Uh, she, she grew up here. So I've been in town for about, well, that's about 24 years now. So um, yeah, time goes by fast. <laughs> Absolutely. Good foundation. And I have to throw this in there, even though it was a tough weekend for us uh, last week, I know you're a Gopher fan. So yes. I appreciate that about you, but uh, what else do you like to do for fun? Uh, you know, uh, I play music uh, somewhat. Really? As often as I can. What do you play? Um, I play bass guitar. Okay. I yep. have no idea how to do that, but yep. so, I'm impressed uh, that you can do it. <laughs> Actually, my father-in-law and I have uh, played uh, music together for, for a long time. That's a really cool. That's yeah. a cool connection to have. Yeah, I don't get to play as often as I used to, uh, but uh, it's nice my... Kids are learning. Uh, my daughter sings. Uh, she plays ukulele. My son plays nice. drums. So uh, eventually, we could have a pretty solid family band. So that's that's one of the fun things we like. To that's do. a cool connection to have. So have you ever done like a public play of any sort, or is it mostly all just private for uh, your own personal enjoyment? Yes, uh, we've played publicly um, several times. Uh, we do a lot of private gatherings. Uh, Weddings, anniversaries, things like that. Really, um, that's awesome. Uh, my daughter uh, will sing with another one of her friends. Uh, they sang at the gazebo last okay. summer. Um, they're hoping to uh, do some more things like that at some uh, open mic nights and things like that. 